everybody. I hope all of you are doing good. This side, Aditi Gupta, data and business analytics mentor. And this video is very, very, very important, especially for you, because this video will help you to understand how to switch from non-IT to IT domain and even without coding. Okay, so make sure that you all watch this particular video till the end. Now, if you want to switch from non-IT to IT domain. It can be a you know serious situation, but not that serious. Why is it so? Because if you have a right mentor in front of you, then what? Why to worry about, right? So I will give you a complete roadmap in the simplest way possible that what needs to be done and what not. So no need to worry. As you can see, we have a simple non-IT domain. Okay, so let me help you with the a proper difference in here. This is non-IT and this is a proper IT domain. Okay, so non-IT domains can be, non-IT domains can be where like we have a core sales, a core marketing department, a core HR department, a core logistics department, a core operations department. Okay. IT can be like, you know, a proper data department of the company, a proper software department, software development department, web development department, uh, some sort of testing somewhere. Okay. So where we're, we need to work with the proper systems, a proper coding. So most of the people think that, okay, so if I want to switch from non-IT to IT domain, we require a coding. Okay, coding can be a core Python, a core R, Java, C, C++, for iOS, we have a multiple iOS languages, Swift and all. So understand one thing, this is for sure, if you want to switch from non-IT to IT, of course you require a coding. Okay, like from sales, if you want to go from a Java development, web development, software development, you need to do coding, right? But there are multiple more options as well where you can switch from non-IT to IT without coding, okay? So in this particular video, we're going to talk about those options which will help you to switch from non-IT to IT without coding, okay? And this is one of my expertise level and I have a huge experience in this particular domain or we can say uh, on this era as well, okay? Now, when it comes to non-IT to IT, okay, so non-IT to IT, okay, so we have this much proper, you know, gap in here. Now, how we can fill this particular gap? If you will go for the profiles like software engineering, web development, software development, iOS development, if you will go for any core development profile, definitely require one or two languages. That is for sure. But if you are the one, don't want coding. So that's the core part in here, right? That if you are the one, don't want coding, then the data industry can be a plus point for you or can be one of the best point for you, okay? You can easily switch from IT to non-IT in the data industry. There is two industries, data and development. Okay, in development, we develop application, we develop websites, we develop, you know, multiple uh, softwares for the companies for smoothen their work. Okay, so in development, we need a coding. Okay, but in data industry, we don't require coding. For an example, in the data industry as well, we have three core profiles. We have data analyst, data scientist and data engineer. Okay, so when it comes to data analyst position, business analyst position, positions like Power BI developer, Power BI consultant, Tableau consultant, SQL developer. For SQL as well, you don't need to work core on coding. This is a structured query language where you understand how to work with the databases, how to extract data, how to clean and manipulate data. So I don't count SQL inside or within coding. Okay, SQL is a different language where you work on different sort of queries and you work on data and manipulation of the same as well. Okay, so if I talk about a data industry as well, you ignore data scientist. Okay, you ignore the data engineering as well. If you want to switch from non-IT to IT without coding, then especially for you, 
द प्रोफाइल्स लाइक डेटा एनालिस्ट बिजनेस एनालिस्ट ओके देन वी हैव पावर बी आई डेवलपर पावर बी आई कंसल्टेंट डेटा विजुअलाइजेशन एक्सपर्ट बिजनेस इंटेलिजेंस एनालिस्ट दीज आर द वेरी गुड प्रोफाइल्स टू वर्क विद ऑल्सो आई वॉल गिव यू मोर प्रोफाइल्स विच इज नॉट रिलेटेड टू डेटा इट कैन बी डिजिटल मार्केटिंग ओके रनिंग एड्स परफॉर्मेंस मार्केटिंग वीडियो एडिटिंग ग्राफिक डिजाइनिंग दीज ऑल आर ऑल्सो कैन बी द ऑप्शन ओके बट If you are looking forward to get a good clients, good companies, good earning opportunities, good packages, then in the data industry and these profiles you can go for. But if you are the one wants to side hustle, for side hustle, these are the things which is which you can go for. But for sure, performance marketing, running ads, digital marketing is also can be a profile or can be an option for you to switch from non IT to IT. Okay. so understand one thing when it comes to data analyst business analyst power bi developer consultant these are the core positions you can go for if you are looking forward for a switch because you don't require coding in these particular profiles okay i'm repeating it again data analyst business analyst power bi developer power bi consultant data visualization and business intelligence analyst these are the core profiles now many students have this confusion that aditi for this as well we need sql language we need a python we need r we need excel and so on but guys i want to tell you one thing if you learn power bi power bi is a tool by microsoft okay it is a powerful power bi it is a powerful business intelligence tool okay or the software for a complete end to end data analytics project so if you learn this particular tool as well it will be easy for you to work on these particular profiles without coding and if you want to learn power bi from scratch if you want to switch from non it to it without coding you can join my workshop as well the workshop link is in the description you can check out right now you can register yourself as well okay now as you can see the best profiles for you all from non it to it is all these particular profiles there are multiple more profiles as well like okay it can be a domain specific it can be other profiles so for that in detail i will gonna make an next video okay for the different more profiles in the data industry but make sure okay from non it to it without coding you can go for a data and business analyst positions that is for sure and companies like capgemini tcs accenture netflix deloitte they all are hiring the people who can effectively work with data and you can be the one okay so make sure that you make your decision today and make sure that you start upgrading your skills in that particular technology as well if you are looking for career transition if you need any help from my end you can just comment and i will gonna reply and i will going to help you in each and every hurdle of yours if you are facing any issues any doubts or anything okay also if you like this particular video make sure that you like you comment and also share it with the concerned person if you feel like okay this particular video can be beneficial for you know your friends or family members make sure that you subscribe this particular channel as well and uh, i will see you in the next video until then bye bye have fun please take care